Meghan Markle always claims that she's 43% Nigerian, so she always finds ways to use Nigerians to make money. Recently, a source revealed that she's looking to become the host of a Nigerian independent scholar this year, but the source says it's not a role that she's taking on for free. She's asked for a too higher fee. Nigerian Independence Scala will take place on September 28, 2024, in Los Angeles. Experience the essence of Nigeria's diverse cultures as attendees showcase captivating dance performances. Marvel at the grace and elegance of the dance competition finalists who battle for the title and a grand prize. The esteemed judges will be on the lookout for innovation, authenticity, and shared talent. Whether you're a Nigerian American, a friend of Nigeria, or simply curious to explore new cultures, this scala promises an experience that transcends borders. Connect with like minded individuals, celebrate the beauty of diversity, and unite in the joyous atmosphere of the gala. Part of the proceeds from this gala will go towards supporting OI Cares. OI Cares is the community service arm of Umu Igbo Unite. If participants donate to OI Cares, they'll receive free tickets while regular tickets are sold for $55 and VIP tickets for $99. According to a source close to WME staff, Meghan Markle has urged her agency to sign her up as host or speaker of the Scala. It always comes with requirements. She wants free admission for Mother Doria and Prince Harry. Additionally, she requested a fee of $1,000 for one night of hosting at the show, even though she had no intention of donating money to oil. The source said that it's possible that Arkell will donate money from the charity, but it won't be significant. Megan will come out as Nigerian, but why does she want to be paid? People are missing the obvious angle here, Nollywood. It's a growing movie industry and very popular around the world. She wants that Nigerian connection and hopes someone will offer millions for a movie. She gives no credence to the fact that she's half-white, was raised primarily by a white father. She let people in school just think she was Italian, and she has lighter skin than most mixed people. She's only using being mixed color to her advantage. I think white and color people don't like her at all. If she wants to reach a route, she should firstly go and sit by her father's hospital bedside and apologize to the proud African-American branch for her family in the form of a mother's siblings, who she snubbed and ignored. If she's 43% Nigerian, that means that Doria is 86% Nigerian. That's her ancestors very diligently marrying and having children with mostly, if not only, Nigerians in us for over 150 to 200 years. This woman is a disgrace. She claims African heritage after doing a lot to physically distance herself from said heritage. She's had a nose job, maybe several, and lightens her skin. She opportunistically embraces and discards her background. She's only suddenly proud of her African heritage because the South Africans danced in the streets for her marriage.